Alright, I've been seeing, seeing these videos that people have been making about them tripping on Benadryl. Alright, I'm going to make a video about tripping on Benadryl, talk about it. Now, this is my insight on it. I, myself, and my brother, Theron, we, tr we took Benadryl for about, I don't know, five, six months together every day just about every day and if we did it we didn't just take no 25 a day we would steal a hundred bottle and we would take that whole hundred bottle in that day not at the same time spacing it out so we wouldn't overdose gotta be smart and the more the first time I ever did it Man, it scared the fucking piss out of me. But for some reason, I wanted to do it again. And so, I got addicted on to it before I met Theron. And I was did it. I quit because I didn't like it. At, after a while, I just decided it's dumb. Then I meet Theron and tell him about it. And he's like, oh, let's do it. And so, we started doing it. And I had someone to do it with me. Fuck doing it by yourself sucks because you're the only one tripping and it just it doesn't work okay now when you do it with someone else oh it's fucking fun as fuck I ain't gonna lie I'm a man of god now I don't do it anymore and in my inside I think the stuff that you see is real because everybody's stories that I've heard we're seeing the same things when I did it with my friend Theron we would see the same people the same things like if some would some person thing that everybody sees would go me and him both be like oh dude did you see that and like you'd always feel like bugs or something like crawling up you and just and you'd feel it and you just sometimes you wouldn't look and you just try to wipe it off but it wouldn't go away so you'd look and then you'd see like bugs and stuff crawling up you. You're like, what the fuck, dude? And you get start getting pissed off because you don't because it wouldn't go away. You'd get pissed off. And my insight is for one, I suggest no one ever do it. It's scary as fuck. But if you do for one, do not do it around family that cares. Because you cannot act like you're not tripping. It's just not going to happen. Tried it, done it at school. I just slept because I was talking to my principal and he didn't even know what the fuck I was talking about. Fuck that. Don't do it. It's bad. But if you do do it, do it around someone who can watch you if they're not tripping so they make sure that you don't do nothing stupid. It enhances the pain and anything that touches you. Like, my insight, I don't like people throwing stuff at me or anything because my reflexes are way off and it, it hurts a lot worse. I tried to take a shower on them and, dude, it felt like I was getting shot, like, fucking by needles, like, in my skin. It scared the fuck out of me. But... You'd see stuff crawling on you, or you'd see gnats, like, flying up, and you'd try to grab it. And, like, you'd open your hand, and there wouldn't be nothing there. And, like, I'd be like, man, you'd be sitting outside a, a gas station just tripping balls, and I'd be like, dude, are there gnats flying around? You'd be like, yeah, the, yeah, there is. All right. When I try to grab it, my hand just go right through it. And I'm like, man, these fucking ain't real. And I noticed that they weren't real. Or, like, if I'd see myself in the eye, if I'd see myself in the mirror and I look at my eyes, dude, they look like fucking pitch black. Man, I have brown eyes because, you know, I'm half black, but my eyes would be looking like they're fucking a demon or something was in me. And one time, I really did think that there was a demon in me. I fucking tripped out and I freaked out and I called all my coaches. And I thought I was possessed, and I was telling people that I was going to kill them. And that's what made me to stop the first time. But once I met Theron, 
he got me to do it again and we the one time we took 200 in a single day it it was the craziest fucking thing in the world i'd see you'd see people and you'd have conversations with people that weren't there and if you do it around people that ain't tripping you'll make their fucking night because you'll fall asleep and you'll go into a daydream and it's not like a little daydream like oh you wake up yeah i was dreaming hell yeah no you wake up and you think that that fucking dream was real and you will finish the fucking conversation that you were having in your dream and everybody look at you like what the fuck are you talking about I was at my friend's house one time and there was like uh, I woke up and I was like hey dude that chick at the store said blah 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 and everybody's like what the fuck are you talking about there, when did we go to a store and I just like oh never mind and I go back to sleep now, once you've done it as long as me, you learn how to stop yourself. And you're like, you, you're able to stop yourself. But when you first start it, you can't stop yourself. You'll just be speaking gibberish. Like, you mix your words up. In your head, you know what the hell you want to say. But, in reality, it doesn't come out like you want to say. And it comes out totally different, and it comes out not even on topic of what you were thinking about and it sucks you you forget everything you cannot keep memory it sucks you can't like you'll be in the, me and there be in the middle of a conversation and I'd be like oh you know that that one time and then I'd be like what were we talking about and then he would reply to what I was talking about him tripping as well he would be telling me what I was talking about and then he'd be like uh what, what was I just saying and then I'd be I'd have to tell him what he was trying to tell me and then I'd be like uh, uh what, what, was I keep, what was I just saying and it would just keep going on and on until eventually we both just lost sight of what the fuck we were talking about everything on Benadryl tastes horrible. If you drink pop on Benadryl, the only thing that doesn't taste really, really, really bad is like Gatorade. That's why anytime I ever did it, I always bought me a few Gatorades because you don't want to drink Kool-Aid, you don't want to drink anything that has a lot of syrup in it because you can taste every single ingredient. Pop tastes horrible. You can taste the acid and everything in it, and it just tastes bad. It's not good. It tastes horrible. And, man, you see the craziest things on there that aren't real. Like, if y'all know what triple C's are, okay, well, we took 25 triple C's, me and Theron and a few other people, and 50 Benadryl each. Now, if you've done Benadryl, you know it makes you tired as fuck and you pass out. Well, if you do triple C's, you know it keeps you awake really high. Okay, when you do both, you're tripping and you're awake. And them things that you see, they don't disappear. They're there. Like, you can you imagine walking and, you know, the little figures that you see? The I'm going to say that they're demons because I think that they're real because everybody sees them. Everybody sees the exact same things. And you imagine one of them things getting in your path. And you know, if you if you've done Benadryl, you know, if you just look away, then it goes away. Well, yeah, it doesn't go away when you're on triple C's. That thing stays there, and you're scared because you're like, oh, what what am I supposed? What am I even supposed to do? Like, it's there and it's not moving, and so you just gotta fucking suck it up and you gotta walk through it scariest thing I ever done <laughs> I did not want to walk through something that I thought was there it scared me half to death you'll hear voices you'll if you're at someone's house and you know their parents are there you'll you'll think that you hear their parents coming or their parents say something to you and you're just freaking the fuck out because you don't want nothing to do with it but I suggest a lot of people 
don't do it. It's not, it's not fun. After a while, I'm not gonna lie. For the first few times, it was fun. For the first five months, it was fun. But it will mess you up. It will mess up your heart really bad. I have very bad liver problems right now. I'm not gonna lie. I still trip to this day when I get if I smoke weed or something. I will trip and I'll freak out at times like I won't freak out in person but in my mind I'm freaking the fuck out because I think too much and I just had to say you will hear voices if you do Benadryl a lot you will hear voices till the day that you die and you will see figures out the corner of your peripherals to the day that you die it sucks it kind of makes you kind of a little bit schizo but if y'all want to hear some more trips of indefinite trips I can go into just subscribe comment I can go really hard into it cause this is a person who's done triple C's been drill I've done a lot of cheap drugs because I'm a poor black kid so, just comment, subscribe, y'all. I'll tell y'all my stories.